Like, bitch, like, did you just hit my friends? Hey, y'all, welcome back to another YouTube video with you tell you, y'all. Y'all haven't seen me in four months, y'all. Like, four going on five months. And I'm sorry about that. But this is the reason that I'm coming to y'all to explain. Because I just feel like I owe it to people who really was watching me. And people who really was supporting me. So, I'm going to tell y'all what happened. Um, I don't want no sympathy or nothing because I'm good. Like, the shit happened. I was mad. Y'all was mad. Um, I don't feel no way, though. It's just like, life goes on. Let go and let go. Like, it is what it is. But to you bitches... Trust you will be dealt with, but anyways, let's get started on the story time. So let's go back to May 5th. May 5th, um, I was in Dallas because I ended up going to get my lashes done that morning at 11. So I ended up getting to Shreveport and I was with my sister Kira. So, um, when I got down there, we're gonna name the friend that I was with, um, her name is Kiki. We're gonna name her Kiki. <coughs> when I got down there. Kiki had texted me and she was like, come get me or whatever. So I was like, okay, I'm finna come get you. So I ended up going to go get Kiki or whatever. Okay, pause. Let me tell y'all, me and Kiki do have history. Me and Kiki is previous best friends. We don't have an issue with each other. Like, it's all love with me. I ain't tripping. Like, I ain't too fucked up about nothing. Like, things happen. Wrong place, wrong timing. But, like, I just feel like I separated myself from that situation. And I separate myself from people like that. Simply because I moved on from stuff like that. All that fighting, arguing. Um, all that. I got a kid. I don't has i got shit to lose like that's the difference between me and other people so it's just like respectfully i feel big but fast forward that whole night we have been in my sister's house we have been drinking or whatever so coincidentally like i was just telling them like yeah i hope we don't see nobody out here we don't like we ain't gotta fight because i want to have fun like this is my first time coming here like i, I be going home every three months so they don't really see me that much like people at home they don't see me that much unless me talk on the phone so um i basically was happy to go out there or whatever so um what happened y'all i can't think hold on give me a second okay so i was happy to go out there whatever so we out there we over there we party you know whatever we get ready to go out or whatever so we ended up going out we went downtown so we stayed downtown for a while with my sister now so my sister and her homegirl wanted to go to a different club so they ended up wanting to go to ants i wasn't 21 at the time but i was 21 now y'all <laughs> bitch let's take a shot i'm 21 what is that? Okay, hold on, y'all. Let's take a shot. I got a little bitty shot love and a little bit of lemonade. All right, y'all. So, I took the shot because I'm 21, bitch. I'm 21. Anyways, so we had pulled over to ends. We got in the truck, we pulled over to ends. It was a security guard. Well, no, it was a police officer at ends door. So, we like, we already know she can't get up and know whatever. I did have a fake ID, but they don't take the ID on the phone or whatever. So, we like, fuck it. Take us back downtown, me and Kiki. So, me and Kiki go back downtown. We had got out the car. We mingled with some people for like 15 minutes or whatever. We like, we finna go stand over there at the other club. So, we walk across the street to the other club. So, we stand at the corner. I really don't remember exactly what happened. Because at this point, okay, before we got out the car with, with, with my sister Kier, we ended up taking like two, three, I ended up taking like two, three shots of Patron. So, like, when I say lit, I mean lit, y'all. My alcohol level when I got to the hospital was 239. You can die like that. Like, I ain't allowed to, I had a blast. Like, despite all this happened, I had a blast. But back to the story. So, anyways... So, we ended up standing at the corner or whatever, and then, like, out of nowhere, a girl walked past me. So, me and my friend standing together, but, like, my friend standing in front of me. So, like, to get to my friend, you got to walk around me. So, the girl, we, we standing there, and out of nowhere, the girl walked, and she hit my friend. So, I'm looking like, bitch, like, did you just hit my friend? So, I immediately just ran into her shit. So, me and her getting at it, getting at it, getting at it. So, I look back, like... In the midst of us fighting, I look back, and when I look back, I glimpse at my friend, and it's two whole other different <laughs> jumping my friend. So, mind you, at this point, I can laugh about this. At this, at this, sorry, at this point, it's three people. So, I just remember we kept running up on them. We kept running up on them. Every time somebody broke it up, we found them again and ran up on them again. So, at this point, we just run up on these bitches, and my hoes grown as fuck. So, oh my god, I'm just cussing. 
I'm just cussing. The last time we ran up on her, okay, so I remember I ran up on her the last time. Me and her fight. The person who I'm fighting didn't didn't hit didn't hit me. So they make four people now, y'all. It was another person who came and grabbed my shirt because I remember like me turned around and when I turned around, that's when I got hit. So what happened was when I turned around, she hit me with the bottle and that's how I had got the ring around my face. When she hit me with the bottle, um, it had dropped out of her hand. So when it dropped out of her hand, we ended up going to the ground. So once we got to the ground, that's how my face ended up getting cut. So this, okay, so I'm gonna show y'all, hold on. I got makeup on right now. But I'm gonna post, I'm gonna give y'all pictures too. But I'm trying to show y'all. So, the ring that you see right here that's from the bottle. This is from the stitches. That's from the stitches. Um, that's from the stitches. I had got cut right there. That's why I look like it ain't only cut my face. I got cut right there, and then I got cut right here on my wrist too. When she hit me with the bottle, like, even when she hit me with the bottle, I still didn't stop fighting. I didn't realize I was hit with the bottle, really. Like, I just know, like, bitch, these some grown bitches you fight, you better not stop swinging. That's all I'm thinking. Like, bitch, you better not stop swinging. Whatever you do, you better not stop swinging. That's all I was thinking. I said, what a guy. Once she hit me with the bottle or whatever, um, and we had ended up going to the ground, I remember we had ended up getting up. But when we was on the ground, we were still fighting. So when we had ended up getting up, um, I'm still like, I think we was holding each other, like we was probably holding each other here or something, because we still had each other. I remember when we got up, we still had each other. So once she did let me go, and like I realized, like it's blood dripping from my face, I end up just walking off. Like I remember, like I just walked off. So when I had walked off, like I'm looking, I'm pissed off at this point. I'm like, bitch, did you let me get jumped? Bitch, did you help me? That's what I'm telling Kiki. Like Kiki, what the fuck happened to me? Like. Why? I, I mean, I'm not knowing, like, I'm not knowing how bad it was. Like, it was bad, but it wasn't, like, horrible. It was bad at the time, but it wasn't horrible. But you got to think about it. I was really drunk, so that's why I was losing so much blood because I lost a lot of blood. So, when I had ended up getting up, I ended up walking, like, walking, like, it was a street. It's a street, like, that way. It's a street. So, it was an ambulance. When you turn on the street, when you turn around on the street, it was an ambulance. So, the ambulance ended up walking to me. We we met each other halfway. So, I was just telling him, like, um, I'm bleeding. Like, can you put something on it? I'm bleeding or whatever. So, he was like, um, hold your face together. So, when he sat there, I'm like, what you mean? Hold my face together or whatever. I'm like, how, how bad is it cutting? And he was like, it's not bad, girl. I'm saying hold your face together because you bleeding. So, I'm just, like, paranoid at this point. I'm like, is it bad to, like, where my baby not going to be able to recognize me being? He was like, girl, no, it's not that serious. So me not knowing, like I never seen my face until I had got to the hospital because I ended up going to the bathroom and that's how I ended up looking at my face. But I ended up getting sedated, so that's why I really didn't remember nothing um that happened that night. I really don't remember nothing from that night after getting out the car with my sister. But okay, y'all, I just really feel like that's enough. I gave y'all the whole story time. That's why I wasn't on Instagram. Um, I am fixing to include the pictures, so actually, let me do that too. This not the end of it. I'm gonna put the picture right here, y'all, so y'all can see. And I'm gonna explain this. So, the circle is when she hit me with the bottle, like when the bottle print actually hit my face, like the bottom of the bottle hit my face. That's what that's from. And then the the part where the stitches is right there that's where like my lip was cut up like from a piece of glass like it was a, it was a cut but it's like from a piece of glass so that's why i had to get stitches from right there to right there right here i had two small cuts so i had to get stitches right there as well i just feel like all in all i learned my lesson of the whole thing that's why i'm not too about it like i just feel like god just telling me like you don't stay attached to something that i separated you from once i separate you you don't go back to that it's over with and that's what i did because that happened the same day me and her got cool out of like three years that's crazy i'm so sorry to have to bring this to y'all like this but yeah y'all it's my birthday oh let me take hold on y'all hold on hold on hold on hold on yeah. Tell the waitress, don't forget the 19 out of Pretty Girls Love 42. Nato, thank y'all so much for watching this video. I love y'all so much, but I've been having a ball, bitch. Thank y'all so much for watching my YouTube, y'all. Make sure y'all like, comment, subscribe, share this video with everybody, y'all. I gotta get rich some way. Hmm.